Elle est là où peep. Uh, uh. <laughs> yes, you can see it's it's night now, but I'm still recording uh, cinema uh, 15 features just for you. You're watching Outside TV. My name is Montensen, and the next new thing in R50 is uh, maybe very useful for people who rambling texture. Holds <laughs> the whole day. Okay, it's 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 uh, uh, to be true. Um, I'm, I'm I'm not using much textures in, in my normal workflow. Yeah, I, I very like to uh, just clicking some shaders together and using the intern uh, shading algorithms and, and noise variations and something to to get some materials, but I like to show you the functionality of this new tool. Yeah. Okay. You know that. Yeah. I just load a, 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 a very old project from from the beginning of this year. Okay, it's not so old, but old in, in any stage uh, like this. Open. Okay, yeah, it's, it's an old scene, yeah, uh, this is bug, and it's in, in a stage, uh, in a very early stage, uh, yeah, and I think, oh, nice, I, I like to do uh, another rendering of this, uh, whatever, click on, oh, oh, no, 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 so much textures are missing, missing, oh, okay, okay, okay. And material, oh, okay, where is it? Oh, here's one, and that, oh, okay, you know, you all know the problem. Now we have to, to uh, handle all these missing textures, yeah, and this is a past. <laughs> then, now, Cinema R15 have, has the very new texture manager, yeah, and the texture manager is a nice little guy. Uh, he shows you all the textures you are missing. <laughs> it's great. So and and um, okay, uh, the, the nice thing is he shows uh, any information he is able to display about this texture. It's funny. Uh, one texture is still yeah. He, he uh, give you some alternate uh, paths to the texture. Great, but there are still so much missing and. Uh, now you can uh, select missing textures. So any missing texture is selected. Then you say we link textures. And uh, okay, from the beginning I go uh, to the project where I have the C4D file. Hey, that's a texture. Now I, I take this open. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Most of them are, are green now. Okay, it's cool. So I select again missing textures and okay there are some over CPD back oh, 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 I have the idea we link London Wardman CPD back open yes okay okay there's just one candidate left is CPD material textures okay we link texture material textures zack well done. Okay, and ta -da. <laughs> So it's, it's a very great tool. There, there is of course uh, uh, more functionality in it, but uh, it's one of the tools I, I didn't uh, check uh, more in the deep. So <laughs> I have to left your with um, just half of the information uh, about this thing. But uh, yeah, the, the, this is very, very useful and uh, I hope uh, now you are uh, invert or uh, relink, re ah, yeah, very great. Uh, maybe you, you can no problem uh, sometimes uh, cinema uh, has uh, absolute passes and, and local passes and texture channels and something uh, and you can uh, more or less uh, reset this thing and, and change to the differences and so and you can replace textures from this yeah you can say uh, 
replace this. Oh, yeah, you see, there, there are the triangles. <laughs> replace this. JPEG with TJA. I don't know how it works. Sorry, I have to show you this uh, some some other time. Um, the first thing I, I like to show you is uh, how nice it's now is to sort and and refine your uh, and relink your, your textures. It's very easy and very handy and very useful. And so we three D artists uh, thanking our master of Maxon. Headquarter and say, Great, you began, saved me some time, and I uh, uh, spent that in the sun. Yeah, but tomorrow, today is too late. I have to sleep uh, in, a few, in a few minutes. Okay, yeah. Uh, I hope uh, you like this new feature too. And uh, feel free to ask me questions. Uh, my name is Most Tenzin. This is Most Live TV, and I see you. Bye bye. <laughs>